Royal Liverpool for Trusen this week. We are off the back tees in round one. Medium wins out of the West. Firm, firm default. So I expect things to be pretty slick here. I, it's it's open conditions, so firm, firm, and something on the faster side is pretty much what I would expect. 141 green, so it's it's not crazy fast, but it's definitely on the faster side. But as long as we can keep fairways and greens going here, we should be okay. A little bit of a push on the first, but it's going to give a center fairway. Really only a big, big concern missing like that if it's on a... Uh, It's on the approach shots. Like especially something like this, we're going after it on the right hand side of the green. So here we get a little bit of a pull fast. Real good distance, right about pin high here. Twelve footer, uphill an inch. Ball's definitely below my feet. Gonna be hitting it firm. You gotta turn just a little bit more than that. Gotta turn just a little bit more than that. Bye, doctor. Bye, doctor. See you soon, doctor. <laughs> Alright. Big drive down here. I think we just send it straight away. Under hitting a lot of our shots at the moment. Not sure what that's all about. Welcome back. Hope all is well with you. Alright. So we've got wind at the back here as well as firmer and faster conditions. So we have to be mindful of that. Tailing wind, I'm not really expecting to play crazy amounts to the right with it being a wedge. But what we do need to make sure of is that we take enough off of this so as to not land it and lose it. 97% again. What in the world is going on with my swing? I have no idea what the deal is with that. Left to right, once we get up there, we're on an uphill lie. It's uphill a little bit to the hole as well. Mmm, just a little bit off. All right, even through the first two. Definitely not where we want to be. There's plenty of golf left, but we're going to have to find some scores. We're going to have to absolutely find some scores. We've got wind in, 305, and then wind. I think if you aim this out to the side here and then play a little bit of a fade... Come on, get down. It's gonna bleed through out into the heavy stuff, isn't it? Yeah, big kick. It's unfortunate. Got a little bit too far out to the left side here. So we're gonna have a tall task because we do not have a good lie out of this rough. We're into wind and we're not really onto the green at all. So 
I feel like we're gonna have to go up a bunch of clubs. Like, this might just be eight iron. Eight iron with a little bit of backspin? I don't know, like, this could... This could carry all the way there. Could end up quite short. Yep, there's the... That's the carry all the way there. But, like, I, I, don't, I don't know what my other options are. I mean, probably find the fairway would have been... Find the fairway would have been the better... Oh for three! Oh for three. I mean, I can't say that we're necessarily striking the ball super, super well. I mean... And did we get too much wind behind on this one? Yeah. So just... And now, now we're just making dumb decisions. Now it's... Now it's a compounding... Now it's a compounding thing. We're gonna have to take a flop shot with a lot of shape on it. And even at that, the flop shot is gonna be, is gonna be long. We gotta partial it a little bit and it's not gonna stop. This is just hoping for a best case scenario here. Ooh, man. Flirted with it maybe a little bit too much. Flirted with it maybe just a little bit too much. Okay, let's try and... Let's try and get a bird. Feels like I get left to right. Somehow there's a right to left break in there. And then the left to right at the end. I don't know what I'm seeing. I don't know what I'm doing, actually. <laughs> I feel like all of a sudden we're playing like some of the some of the worst golf that we've played. All of a sudden we're playing some of the worst golf that we've played in a while. Alright. Gotta steer the ship. Gotta steer the ship. Finished Red Dead last night. We were in tears. Not ready for the emotional trauma, even though you knew the emotional... What the emotional trauma was. I've... I can't personally say that I've ever had that sort of connection with a game. But I think that that's a very cool thing that... That it can do that, you know? I don't think we can get this five iron where we want it to, but I feel scared to take the four. We've we've actually struck that well. Came up shorter than I wanted it to. I feel like the next club is out the back of the green, but that's probably probably ends up being the better. Probably ends up being the better shot. Alright. Just gotta clip this up. We're on the board! We're on the board. Okay. Killing off the dry spell. What's going on, Billy? All right. Needed that. Needed that. 
pins. Pins all the way in the back. Wind in on us. I need a little bit of loft. Try and slow this down once it gets onto the green. Okay, finally getting a couple of good strikes. Can this release the way that we need it to to the hole? Wow, okay, so that actually that actually checked up. Four iron there, does that mean that it's uphill? I mean, it's saying that it's flat. This looks uphill, but it's saying flat. Hey, what's going on, Hebo? How you doing, man? Checking in for true sim rounds, your favorite rounds? Everybody's favorite rounds, yeah? Or am I the only guy that actually likes this stuff? So hungry, nine weeks from now seems so long. Yeah, I mean, like, big picture definitely seems like a long time, but it's always the type of thing that... It'll probably go by pretty quickly. But when looking at it big picture, yeah, definitely. Yeah, I'm seeing ball above the feet. Kind of seeing it drift back at the end. But everything... Okay, come on. Let's turn this thing around here. Let's turn this thing around. I've got one or two that like true sim, you'd outlaw it. I just, I don't know, I like, I like that you can miss stuff. I like that you can miss stuff and not immediately be out of it. That's not to say that you can miss everything, but... Gonna get away with one there. It's a horrible swing plane. But I just, I like with Trusim that it's not... You know, that par train at the start doesn't mean I'm out of this tournament. This was plat, I'd be hard pressed to make it from here. I guess that counted as a push that came off pretty sharp right. But it's off to the center of the green, so I think we've got to be okay with it. Tough pin to get after. Got left to right break. Although that's kind of telling me the opposite now. Getting mixed signals. Now that's got to definitely still be left to right. Maybe not a lot at the end here, but... Oh, come on. How does that... How does that stay that straight? Ah, I still... I do wish, though, that there was something... Something in between. I wish that there was something in between that just helped with those... Between green reads, because that's... That's the only thing that's, like, very lacking. Makes it a very big guessing game. Don't like to play more than 18 minute rounds. Tough to shoot well in 18 minutes on true sim. Yeah, like it, you know, it's that much closer to real golf, right? Not that it is real golf, but it is the type of thing that you have to actually, actually try and give stuff a read.
Where are these short swings coming from? It's like something changed in my head between between warm-ups and this, where all of a sudden I'm just under-hitting everything. Alright, so again, I'm seeing the gradual left to right. But is it actually flatter? I don't know. Like, this one's gonna break the other side, isn't it? Oh, wow! We're gonna turn back for some reason at the end? Sure, sign me up. That makes sense. What? What in the world? Like, what in the world? I don't... That I don't follow. Okay, see, like, there's the overcompensation. So we're gonna go long on this one. Have to try and make a putt from back here. So we go from 97%. Now I've got... Yeah, now we're hitting the, uh... The 102. So something just... Feeling a little unnatural today. I mean, I guess that's bound to happen from time to time. It just sucks to happen at the open. It's definitely not what we would prefer. So what? Double breaker? Trying to visualize where I think this putt is going to go. It's got to come back, though. This close. This close. That could be a little bit to do with aim. That could be a little bit of pace. I mean, pick your... <laughs> pick your poison there. Nearly, nearly hold another one to get ourselves at five under through the front, which would have been a really, really nice spot to be. Okay, we've got wind off the right. Ball's a little bit above the feet. Wind should play in just a touch, but I feel like we need a little bit of spin to... slow it down just a touch. Touch slow, but I think I'm okay with it. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. I put a lot of faith that the uh, the wind wasn't going to do nearly as much there. That's why I put a little bit of backspin on it. Okay, we're starting to we're starting to flip the script here a little bit. If we can make a run down the back. We should set ourselves up pretty nicely. Very very slow start, but that's what I. It's exactly what I'm talking about. Is that true sim? Though you may start slow, you are not immediately out of it. And that's pretty much to me the best part. That and greens are, are a very neutralized thing, right? In the main tours, you know, like you're always going to have platform input differences, but the fact that nobody has 
you know, there's no, there are no greens to complain about, so to speak. You know, can't be that grids are better. Haven't tapped out either, and you're on hole eleven. So much heart. Trying to, trying to get those brownie points. I appreciate it, man. I'm glad it's interesting enough to stick around for. That's the, that's the goal. This should sit pretty nicely. Come on, let's convert. Just cracked a hundred thousand? Oh baby. Oh baby. Some big old points. Come on. I tried to, I took the aggro line because I didn't, I didn't see that much in it. And then it does that on the way back even more than the way through. Am I going to miss high now? That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. I, okay. Okay. How does that even, how does that even break that much? But that's why, like, that's why I always get hesitant to put the extra power on, because I don't want that to happen. I think we have to be bold. Cut the corner. A little bit of a push. We're gonna go out the other side of the fairway. Okay. So, back to back here, we are not in the greatest of spots. Back to back, we have put ourselves into some trouble. I'm gonna go gap wedge. I'm just expecting a lot of rollout from the heavy rough. Because on the earlier hole, we took what we clubbed up to like an eight iron and we ended up out the back, so kind of figured I would rather be in a position like this. Don't know if it's the uh, the right position to be, but... See, I'm seeing a bunch of tilt here, but from the side, I'm not seeing as much. So, I'm going to have to probably play it somewhere in between. Like here. Come on, man. Come on, man. We are like, we are dancing some of these putts right around. Oh boy, okay. Eagles suck. In this game, they're great though. All right, 178 to the front. See, if I try and take, that's, that's the straight line at it. It's such a tough. All right. Getting a little risky, getting a little frisky with this one, because I want it. Pull fast. I mean, I I was I was asking for it though, right? I was asking for it though. I was asking myself to hit a perfect shot. A 
That's gonna roll out. Yeah, I just, I couldn't put backspin on it. I didn't trust, I did not trust the result. Swing plane has not been on my side today. Ended up being straight. I just, I saw, I saw movement at my feet and I couldn't not play it. Saw movement at my feet and I just, I couldn't not play for it. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna take three wood this time as much as it pains me. As much as it pains me because we took driver, we've ended up in the rough. It's been giving us a hard time in control. Back to three under. The round of what could have been. The round of what could have been. Where is all of this wind coming from? It's not that much wind. How are we this far off base? I understand nothing sometimes. What? Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm trying to put. I'm trying to put shape on here, game. I knew, I knew, I knew, 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 knew this was gonna be tough, and then. Swing hasn't been 100% and we've we've made some mistakes. Yeah, it's a tough tough pill to swallow. Tough pill to swallow. Doesn't mean that you can't put together. I mean, we've been fighting this whole time. 267. Like this is one of those ones where you land it, like, right at the front edge, I guess? I don't know that we want to go right at the flag. But, like, let this drift back to the left of the flag and... Like, the pull... Pull fast. It's gonna kick left. Okay, we're still on. Keep coming back? I don't know that that's gonna come back at all. Forty-nine footer down an inch, lots of left to right, so it seems. Hard to really tell. How is it at the hole? That's kind of the big thing. Feels like it's downhill a lot behind it, so... I'm gonna try and just lag this one up here. Gonna hit it pretty firm. I have to think it's gonna move a little bit as we go, and then just kind of break down around the end. Oh, we're breaking the other way! That's really enjoyable. And there's a tiny bit back at the end. I, yeah, it's just, it's so hard to read at distance. I mean, it's so hard to read this putt. You know? So, 7 feet versus 49 feet, like, both just... Feels so difficult to get right. I'm somehow still gonna miss it low. Yep, that makes sense. That always seems to be the case! Yeah, I think we're just, uh... We might just be doomed this week. We might just be doomed this week unless we figure some magical... Magical three rounds out. 
Oh my goodness. 125. See, but I think the wind's gonna play in on us a bit. So I gotta give it just a little bit to cut through the wind. It's a little fast, but I'm I'm kind of liking where we're going with this. Need to release a little. No, oh, but it checks up. So are we into a slope? Yep. Two inches uphill stops us short. But it's like we're also below the hole, but I'm seeing some right to left in this. There we go. Oh boy. Mm. What a what a rough round. What a rough round this has been. What are we thinking on this? It's got to be pitching wedge. It's got to be pitching wedge, but I think we're a little bit long with it. I don't want to take too much off though because I feel like loft and backspin into this wind. <sighs> Swing plane. Pain. Pain, pain, pain. Left to right. Up the hill. See, but like this way almost looks right to left, which... So I'm gonna play the start straighter and then just play for left to right. See, like, I'm not crazy to see random right to left in it. What is with these greens? Why do things not make sense with what you see? Ah, it's so trippy. It's so trippy. Like I said, I see some right to left, but then other angles I see left to right. I don't know what it is. I, like, I genuinely don't know what it is about the contours of the greens, but, like, without being able to physically walk on it, you're just, like, you're left to your own imagination. Oh, that's some crazy stuff, man. That is some crazy, crazy stuff. I don't think we even get to the 250 mark with this club, which would mean 27 yards of bounce and roll out. Three wood is definitely long. But I feel like if you take this three wood, maybe play like a big fade into it. There you go. There you go. Ooh, six under. That was, that was not pretty. That was not pretty. Two eagles keeping us afloat. We can't really let uh, the big things, can't let the birdies, or can't let the bogeys happen. Can't let the bogeys happen the way that we did there. Um, but also, like, our swing was not... <laughs> was not good. But that's round one in the books. That's round one in the books. We've got three left to fight. We're five off the lead here. We're gonna need... We're gonna need some big ones. 